It starts with Solomon Thomas up front. He's one of the great players in this country. We can talk about Solomon all you want. Solomon is a, is a freak of nature. Boy, Solomon Thomas, so strong and quick. He's bigger, he's stronger, he's faster. Who's the most talented defensive player on the team? And that's the answer, number 90. You know, you, don't, you just don't see athletes like him. Solomon Thomas picked it up after Alfieri knocked it loose, and he's going to roll to the end zone. I want to be one of the best in the nation. I want to be one of the best in the conference. You know Solomon Thomas on the field. Fast, ferocious, unrelenting. But many don't know Solomon Thomas off the field. Jedi, 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 Jedi. Goofy, gentle, friendly. No doubt Thomas has a diverse personality rooted in his unique background. I was born in Chicago, lived there for about a year, then spent about six years in Australia. I was huge in swimming and soccer. Moved to Texas in fourth grade. People were just, you have to like, what are you doing? You're not playing football because I wasn't signed up or anything. Like you're a huge kid. And I was like, okay, I guess we'll try. Thomas picked up football and ran with it. He quickly became one of the most coveted recruits in the nation and set his sights on the West Coast. From day one of practice, the Cardinal knew they had a special player on their hands. Going against Solomon in practice is not, it's not fun. i am teased the defensive coaches saying, you know, every once in a while, we're gonna have to give him a day off so we can actually get the ball off. I felt like I got in a groove. I felt comfortable, I felt relaxed. I felt like uh, I knew exactly what I was doing. The season built up, I was learning, progressing. By his sophomore season, Thomas was starting to realize his full potential. He was a force that had just been awakened. Out here with the team. On the way to see Force Awakens. Grab my Jedi. I'm a big Star Wars fan. I've seen it three times. I'm a huge fan. We're gonna die. May the Force be with us. The Force continues to be strong with Thomas. After a career-high 12 tackles, one and a half sacks, and a forced fumble in week eight against Notre Dame, he earned his second Pac-12 Defensive Player of the Week honor. Solomon Thomas with another sack. I still believe he's just scratching the surface for what he's gonna do in this sport, but I think also what he's gonna do in this world. You always wanna set the highest expectations for yourself. I set them high so I train harder, work harder, take it more seriously, and just uh, love it even more. 